Hello, and welcome to Ian's 360 vlog. Uh, this is my second ep episode. I'm totally lying. Uh, I made three other ones, but then I kind of disabled them because uh, they were stupid and I was oversharing. Um, I realized, yeah, I wanted to be like super honest, like really just say exactly what's on my mind. And then... Um, you kind of realize that doesn't that doesn't work very well, especially for people that don't like really know you, um, and especially when you have a day job, uh, because there's nothing that motivates people more than um, their emotions. So, life lesson. Ah, cue the awesome music. So this is a fun little tune. And it doesn't really go with Switzerland. I should find some yodeling music, but you know what? I'll do that in the next episode. Uh, which, uh, yeah, so Switzerland's amazing with my friend Adrian. And uh, we did uh, some cool stuff. Uh, I went up on a, a para, paragliding, paragliding thing, and that guy flipped around so many times that the G-forces made my face, like, slip off my skull. It, it looks like my somebody it looks like god is yanking at my mouth he's making funny faces with my fairly loose skin on my face because i'm in my 40s so oh yeah by the way i'm in my 40s oh and i have to try and make this i can't swear which is one of my favorite things to do i'm a very vulgar person uh, verbally um but uh, i actually marked this video as kid friendly because uh, I don't want to turn people off. And you know what? Actually, I like kids. I don't have any. Uh, which kids? Um, you know, try and have kids fairly young. Not while you're kids, but when you're adults. Well, but when you get to an adult age, like in your 20s, you know. Try and, have, try and have a kid then, because you only get uglier. And so, yeah. Mother Nature. Uh, she's a... Uh, She's vicious. So. <laughs> I could still have a kid. Maybe I'll like, maybe I'll go to the foster home and get a kid, you know? And just, because, you know, like a grown kid, it's like a rescue kid, you know? Because I have a rescue cat. It's like already five years old and she already knows where to poop. Um, which that might actually be the fun part of raising a child is, you know, when they're cute, right? From zero to two. <clears throat> but when they already know how to poop, then maybe they're still cool. I don't know, how could you, you probably wouldn't want to adopt a teenager from a foster home because then they're probably like really angry, you know? I could run a foster school and be like this overlord, but like in like a Santa Claus way, I could be like Santa Claus of the foster. All right, I don't know. I'm just going on a tangent here, but uh, this is beautiful, right? So crazy. And this is a 360 video, so you can move your finger, make it move around and stuff. <clears throat> so my first episode was a year ago, if you can believe it. <laughs> and the video was, was a, a little older than that. And this video is a little older. I actually got a better camera, but that's coming. I've got so many 360 videos. I bought like four eight terabyte hard drives and uh, don't worry there's another song coming up here it's actually a longer song um oh and i should i should give credit to the awesome people just donating their music if you can believe it uh so we just listened to i feel like partying right now by nat keith and beat mower and soon we're gonna queue up bright eyed blue blues by unicorn heads and, uh, oh, it's coming up, I think. Yeah, there we go. Oh, doesn't that sound amazing? All right. Oh, uh, so, oh, guess what? It's the coronavirus time. I'm stuck in my apartment during coronavirus. And in fact, you know what? I, I need to put that in the title. Coronavirus time. Uh... It's, it's 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 interesting I am definitely getting uh, fatter <clears throat> but
but I've been trying to go out on a bike ride, which, you know what, riding around on your bike is not, it's actually, it's good exercise if you're older, because it does, it's like zero impact, zero impact, uh, which means your, your bones aren't going to hurt, but uh, I, I don't really get any, there's no hills, so you just kind of coast around, it's really lame exercise. I, uh, oh, and I ate two Popeye's chicken sandwiches, and no, they are not sponsoring me. But they are insane. I ate one last night for the first time in my life. I was I asked for uh, one of those uh, wh- whatever people are killing themselves about or, or the homicide sandwich. I thought that was funny. And the guy actually knew exactly what I was talking about because there was people that were killing each other over Popeye's chicken sandwiches. And after I had it, I realized I would kill somebody over this amazing okay now children if there's any children listening because i marked this as age appropriate don't kill people don't ever 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 kill anyone ever okay all right that was uncle ian's advice uh for this episode <clears throat> but that sandwich was so good that i bought like four of them and uh, i gave two of them to uh a couple baristas that uh work at this coffee shop that i can't sit at anymore because the coronavirus. I'm really trying not to swear right now. Um, actually, I did. I did take one of their seats for the employees only. I was like, I'm, I'm sitting here. I don't care. And open up that bathroom because I have Corona all over my fingers. Because I, 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 I went to the Popeyes and I bought them like four sandwiches. And then I was like, Here's sandwiches. I bought you sandwiches. And they're like, Oh, that's okay. I already ate. And I was like, No, I, I didn't ask. I said, I bought you sandwiches and you're going to take them. And uh, and they were like, oh thanks, and they they wouldn't they wouldn't uh, make eye contact with me um, because I was so aggressively forcing these sandwiches on them that I just bought. And, you know, take a sandwich. It's not gonna hurt you. Ugh. Just take a sandwich. I spent four bucks trying to hook you guys up with some amazing sandwich experience, and you're like, no, that's okay, no thanks. I mean, just just take the sandwich. Ugh, I swear. There's actually a rule in Japan I heard, maybe this is a total lie, that uh, if you refuse a gift, you're a jerk. Um, I think that applies in the United States as well. So uh, so they did take the sandwiches begrudgingly. Uh, so kids, look that word up, begrudging. Anyway, I'm stuck in here. Uh, my cat has been... Um, harassing me for food way too much food uh, and she is as fat as I am I'm fairly fat and she's also fat which is sad uh, I'm actually dating one of the baristas if you can believe it I'm actually dating someone it took years I have issues uh, and I guess it doesn't bother her that I'm this fat. It does bother her because she keeps giving me suggestions on how not to be fat. And then she'll bring over fried chicken. I don't know what her problem is. She thinks it's healthy. Like, fried chicken is really healthy. Oh, and all the all the, the pastries, leftover pastries, you know. So she puts them in a bag. They're all crushed together. They're, like, really nasty. <laughs> But she's a barista. She doesn't make any much. She doesn't make any money. So she's like the barista manager. All right. Enough over. Am I over sharing? Okay. I hope you guys are liking the music at least. I don't really have any personal stories other than um, too much salt in my diet, and now I'm like I'm so bloated that my underwear doesn't even fit. Ugh. It's like cuts off my circulation. Is this still, is this still, this still, okay, age appropriate? All right, whatever. Sorry to make you guys imagine a fat person in some underwear. All right, this is so stupid. Okay, well, anyway, if there's anybody listening to this, I hope that uh, it was at least comforting uh, or takes away some of the boredom from being stuck inside. Thank you, Cuomo, or whatever your name is, de Blasio. I guess it's good. Anyway, lots of love. Uh, we're coming to the end. I love you guys. 
I love everybody. Listen to my next episode. And uh, good luck out there.